Welcome to the latest episode of Millennial Money. Now, this week we're following on from last week's video and we're talking about 0% balance transfers on credit cards. So if you've got debt you've accumulated and you're trying to repay it, then one of the best ways is to cut the interest rate you are paying and it's to look for a 0% deal. Now, Lauren's going to talk about a lot of the detail because you've just done this recently, haven't you? Yeah. I mean, I've done it before, but Lauren's just done it recently. So she's going to take you through it. Yes. Yeah, so when I took out my first ever credit card, I took out a 27 month 0% interest credit card and it was great. But when I got to the end of that, I had a little bit left over. And then as the credit card debt gets lower, somehow things crop up and you end up putting things on there to pay for it. So it racked up a little bit. And I ended up paying interest that I didn't really want to pay. So I thought, oh, I'm going to do um, a credit card balance transfer. So to do a balance transfer, it means you take the full amount that you have on your credit card and transfer it over to another credit card, which is 0% interest. So it means rather than paying the interest on your current credit card, you take all of the amount off and then the credit card that you're transferring your money to pays off the debt that you've got on your current credit card. So it means you're transferring the balance from one to another and on the current credit, the new credit card, the balance transfer credit card, you don't pay any interest on the amount that you've put on there. So when you look to take out a, a balance transfer credit card, you can get different ones. Most of them all have 0% interest. Some of them don't. Um, but that depends on your credit score. But if you manage to get one with a 0% interest, they come with different terms and different balance transfer fees. So a balance transfer fee is generally around 3% of the um, amount that you're transferring over. Some of them before have actually managed to transfer over money with no fee at all. But this time, unfortunately, I got charged a 3% fee for transferring it over. But I think it ended up being about £90. So it wasn't it wasn't a massive amount, but obviously that's something that you don't really want to be paying. So it's just something to bear in mind. But also when I transferred it over, when I filled out the form online, everything, it was almost instant. Um, I paid the fee and um, it paid off my other credit card because you have 60 to 90 days to transfer over the balance. Also, one thing to remember with a balance transfer credit card is they cannot be used for purchases. So if you uh, transfer the balance over if you went to use that credit card for purchases if it let you you'll be charged a really high interest rate so the idea of a balance transfer credit card is basically to save you paying interest on your other card so don't use it for spending because you'll get charged a high rate. and that's and that's the thing you've got to bear in mind that credit card companies don't love you they're doing this because they want you over on their credit card because they want to be able to make money out of you so they charge you a fee for because if they're not charging you any interest they're going to try and make money somehow so that's why they charge you the upfront fee but once they get you over there they're hoping you're going to relent you're going to start spending money and therefore they can charge you high interest rates on that money that you borrow so that's why they do it they're not doing it because like i say because they like you the other thing to bear in mind lauren sort of hinted at it there is that just because a deal is advertised it doesn't mean you will get it so there are rules stipulating how many people can get a certain deal that's advertised, or so what percentage of the people that apply. But what deal you get will depend a lot on your credit score and your credit history. So you may apply for a 0% credit card for, uh, say, let's say it's got a two, three year window. You might not get that whole term for their interest rate because that's what happened to you didn't know yeah so when i transferred mine over it was advertised 18 month 0 percent interest and uh, with a lower percentage rate for when that 0 percent period ran out when i actually applied and um, everything was fine it moved over but they reduced the term of 0 percent um, interest so it actually went down to a 12 month term instead of an 18 month term and um, so that was due to obviously my my credit score and then also the interest rate went up and I got the highest percentage balance transfer free a fee so I got the three percent instead of I think they were also advertising two percent so obviously that affected me another thing to remember is if you do apply for a balance transfer sometimes lenders um, have the ability to reduce the amount that they're willing to accept on a new credit card so if you apply for three thousand pound to transfer over sometimes they will only offer you two thousand pound credit limit so you have to also bear that in mind but that depends on the lender and your credit score as well so if you use the idea of balance transfers zero percent balance transfers with the tips we said in the last video you can see how you can start to be able to clear debt 
more quickly because that's really why you should be using them and you try and pay them more than the minimum amount so you can clear their, that debt quickly and the other thing to bear in mind is you can do balance transfers more than once so when that deal comes to an end there's nothing to stop you going to find another balance transfer deal in the future and moving on to that one with a 0% interest rate as well but of course bear in mind every time you take out a credit card and do a credit check it is noted on your credit report so I think that's it are yeah. we done? Yeah, we're done for this week. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us over on our social media. So our Facebook, Money to the Masses, our Instagram, at Money to the Masses, and our Twitter, at Money to the Masses, with the number two. And if you have any questions, email me, lauren at moneytothemasses.com. Thanks so much for watching.